Hi guys, welcome back to another plan with me. This week I'm using this adorable kit from the Orange Umbrella Company and our Orange Umbrella Co. And uh, I just thought that the little houses were super cute. And again, I'm trying to use up all of the kits that I have left in this planner before the year ends because I will be moving to the A5 size. So I'll need different size kits for next year. So um, I'm going to try to go ahead even though this might look kind of springy i figured i'd go ahead and use that now and um we are staying home the rest of this week so well not necessarily from home and or from work and school but i will be home for a couple days so i just thought that was a cute kit and thought this would be pretty and figured i would go ahead and use this especially because it's also not yet fall. So I wanted to go ahead and use a more springy or summery kit while it's not um, officially fall yet. So we are getting there though. And I am actually filming this today is Tuesday the 14th when I'm filming this because we got home super late last night from my brother's wedding. He got married on Sunday and so we didn't get home until super late last night. So I'm just now filming this and hoping to have it uploaded tonight and, um, and post it but we will we will see how that goes because I have kids and I have a lot of work to do here's my I've already made to-do list for this week because I've already gotten started working for today so I went ahead and updated my to-do list so far for the week so um, lots to do to kind of catch up from being out of town but that's okay I think it'll still be a pretty decent week so I will probably go ahead since I flew home last night I think I'm gonna get tested for the virus on Wednesday just to be sure I am double vaccinated but um, I just wanted to go ahead and check since I was out of town so anyway I like I work in a building where there's lots of children and um, there's adults with disabilities sometimes so I just want to make sure that I'm protecting everybody else that I work with and also my children because I have two kids that can't be vaccinated yet so anyway all of that spiel to say that I will be staying home most of the week. So I just thought that the little houses were super cute. And I like, I love the colors, the green, and the little clouds. I just thought it was super pretty. So this will be the kit, kit that I use this week. So sit back and relax. I am drinking water out of a water bottle, which is pretty unusual for me. I usually have my cup, but um, it was dirty. I need to get it washed. Um, so Anyway, just drinking a good old-fashioned bottle of water right now, but sit back and relax. I will probably just pull some random date dots to use with, um, with these date covers, and I will go ahead and set up my week and see what it's going to look like. I usually, I will say, I usually set up what time I'm going to start work, but today... I started around 8, so which normally I'll start kind of closer to 9 if I'm going into the office because then I can take my kids at 7.30, work out from 8 to 9, and then be at work at 9. So this week will be a little bit different, and also I didn't work yesterday. So well, um, it'll be a little different than the usual, but mostly the setup is the same. Sit back and relax, enjoy some music, and play in with me. Okay, so I just went and looked at some of my leftovers because I don't have, I'm going to use these as kind of like work labels. Um, so I don't really have anything to cover up this purple, which doesn't actually match the kit. And I found this from, I believe, yeah, that's Planner Kate. So I think this kind of matches that pink in the planters well enough that I think that will work. So I love using up leftovers because I don't like to waste stickers. So I will go ahead and put that in. I 
That needs to be whited out because I don't like that. Yeah, I really like that. I think that'll work really nicely. Then I can put this guy down. Okay, thank you for your service. And then I actually did not eat until super late last night, so I'm going to put this on the 7 p.m. sticker. We also flew from about 5.30. We actually didn't even... I'm going to move this. I know that sounds crazy, but just to be more um, accurate since this is kind of after the fact planning. Um, I didn't eat until close to like 8.30 or maybe even 9. I don't know. The flight was like 5.30 to about 7.30. So I'm going to use one of these. I think I'll use... No, I'm going to use those clouds because you know, you're flying through the sky. Makes sense. Okay, so I will fill that out. And then we had brunch before we left the wedding with all of the party and the family and stuff. Um, we had brunch at 11 to 12. So I will put that in there too. And I will do all my writing in a little bit later. And then let's see. I'm also going to use this leftover checkbox from... Um, let's see. I'm going to put it up here. And then I'll do my Duolingo and Word. And a uh, Word. I'll do my Duolingo and Read stickers there. And I'm just going to continue this little tradition, I guess, of using these leftover Planner Kate check boxes for my Duolingo and Read. Okay, that's it for that and I did do my Duolingo and I read yesterday on the flight so again I'll put in all of this stuff in a little bit and I will go ahead and do my work day for today we start out at about 8 a.m. I said we, I started about 8 a.m. this morning. I'm working from home today. I'll have to see if I have any day off stickers to put here. But I've been working from home today, so I wanted to go ahead and get that in. But I have all my Duolingo and Read stickers. And looks like I have my to-do list and like I said I'll put I'll use these bars to kind of put in what time I start work each day because it's going to be a little bit different every day this week probably so I don't want to really wanna, you know put that in quite yet because I'm not sure so here is everything set up for Wednesday and Thursday and then it looks like we've got Friday and Saturday pre-set up so all I need to do now I think is just get in the holidays so it's a pretty simple week so far we'll see how it um you know evolves as the time goes by so let's get some holidays out okay so as always we will start with the craft penguin planner 
And for the 13th, yesterday we had National Peanut Day. And for today we have National Cream Filled Donut Day. Yum. For Wednesday the 15th, we have International Dot Day. Maybe Dippin' Dots will have a sale. Who knows? 16th is Thursday, we'll have National Collect Rocks Day. Friday is the 17th, we have Constitution Day. And then for the 18th, we have International Red Panda Day. Cute. And we have International Talk Like a Pirate Day on the 19th. All right, mateys. Sorry, I know that was like super cringy, but couldn't help myself. Okay, that's it for our crafting on planner. And then we have the 13th is Positive Thinking Day. That's really nice. And then the 14th, we have National Creamfield Donut Day again. Wednesday, we have this, or let's see, the 16th, I'm sorry, that's Thursday, we have um, Working Parents Day, which includes me and my husband. We are both working parents. Friday is the 17th, and we have National Apple Dumpling Day. Yummy, yummy. Sounds like a very fall kind of treat, which is not quite officially fall, but it's starting to feel like fall. The 18th, we have National Cheeseburger Day. Yum. Love a cheeseburger. And then we have Wife Appreciation Day on the 19th. I will have to make sure that Ryan knows that. He can appreciate me in a pirate's voice. Okay. And then, oh, this is the 19th also. We have National Dance Day. That's cool. Okay. All right, so that's everything for Planner Kate. And then we have Live Creative Day on September 14th. This is the Chrissy and Designs Celebrations Collection, which I will continue to get. Um, let's see. That is today. I will continue to get these. I probably won't get Planner Kate or, or uh, Craft Penguin Planner next year just because it's a lot of holidays to keep up with. So then we have Online Learning Day is September 15th. Huh. I wonder if this was like a thing before, you know, the world blew up, shut down, whatever. So the 15th is online learning day. And then we have Yom Kippur starts on September 15th, which is here. Actually, I'm going to put this kind of, I'm going to put this up here, actually. Oh, it's kind of nice. The blues look good together. And then the 16th, we have guacamole day, which sounds delicious. Ooh, and it's Thursday, which will, means we'll probably be going out to eat either to a Mexican restaurant or maybe the Cuban place or something. But I'll get guacamole if I go out to eat. And then that is it. We don't have anything else until the 20th. So that is it for the Chrissy and Designs kit. And then I also just realized that I forgot to put on the dig dots for two days of the week this week so let me go get those back pull back together and i'll get those put in okay so again i'm going to use these leftover planner cake date dots because i have all the days that i need because monday was the 13th it is tuesday today when i'm filming this Wednesday is the 15th. Okay, that looks much better. Now I know what day of the week every, or what the date is every day this week. So anyway, I think this is it. I am just going to kind of leave it pretty basic with you know holidays and then i do already have my to-do list made out for the week and i'm going to fill in sort of everything that happened yesterday probably sticker the mess out of this and make it look super cute so 
I hope you guys enjoyed this and I hope you guys have a great week or are having a great week so far when you see this and have a great rest of your day today. Thanks so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, share, and see you next time. Bye.